Right guys, so welcome back to a new edit. So yeah, my last edit's been, oh, I think it must be five to six weeks ago. Um, what was my 100 mile XC ride down to Hastings and back. So I've got the complete contrast for you. I'm actually going bike park wells next week with a few of my mates for my birthday. So I'm just setting my bike up now for bike park wells. Completely different setup to what I had for my XC ride down to Hastings. I'm raising my front end up. I'm looking, uh, I'm opening up all my suspension. I'm gonna need all the travel I can get. So I've, I've put my spacer underneath my stem. I've turned my stem, flipped it upside round so it rises instead of going into a negative rise. Um, so yeah, I just want my front end nice and high because I'm gonna be doing descending. I don't need my front end low for my XC riding and my climbing. Um, and I'll play about with my tire pressures. I'll, I'll be taking some uh, uh, some PSI out for a little bit more traction. So yeah, just getting the bike set up, giving it a one a once over, um, taking my full face helmet with me, my 100% full face helmet, uh, my goggles, my knee pads. Got to say a big thank you to my mum and dad because I've had my 510 shoes for a year now, and as you can see there. They're pretty beaten up. There's, there's still a little bit of life in them, but they're 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 pretty beaten up. So I'll probably uh, put them up for sale for a nice cheap price. And yeah, thanks to uh, my mum and dad, nice early birthday present. They treated me to some nice new shoes. So uh, yeah, I'll be uh, rocking them for bike park wells, and I think they go extremely well with my Yeti. So yeah, my. Uh, my, my plan for my Yeti, I think I said it before, is I'm, my heart's really in XC riding, but I do love to go out through jumping and descending. And I'd love to turn this into a full XC bike. I want to get some XT uh, Shimano clipping pedals and shoes, um, get some carbon fiber wheels, some carbon fiber bars, make it extremely light and just... Um, a full-on XC bike and what I'd love to do is buy a, either an SB6 or an SB150 for all my descendants so bike park Wales, Pease Lake all the gnarly places with the jumps I'll have a bike for that and a bike for my, my miles my XC riding so yeah I'm just uh I'm really looking forward to it it's, it's quite nice um, it's been a while since I've gone and done any jumps or descending um, from my last YouTube edit, what was five to six weeks ago, um, have I done any more riding since then? Yeah, of course I have. I've been out a lot, but I don't want to bore you guys with the same content of my local XC ride. So for any of you that follow me on my Instagram, what's tom.hub87, uh, will know that I've been, I'm out all the time and I've, I've put little videos on there. So if you'd like to check that out, feel free guys. Um, and I've got to say a massive thank you as well. 241 of you guys have subscribed to watch me ride my bike um, but I will be honest with you guys I'm not going to be that uh, consistent YouTuber uh, family life comes first my girls come first so and I don't want to bore you with the same videos and bore myself you know because I do YouTube I don't expect anything from YouTube I just do it for fun for myself to look back on so I'd rather wait you know two month, a month two months and then do a video of somewhere different and fun and yeah for me to look back on and not to bore you guys so uh, sure i could go out and do video videos all the time make edits all the time but it just be my local xc riding so yeah if you're looking for a consistent youtuber guys unfortunately that's not me i'm not going to be someone who puts the same kind of video up every two weeks i'll probably wait a month or two months wait until i go somewhere a bit new and exciting and then uh yeah do an edit for you so yeah, I think I'll uh, finish checking all my nuts and bolts on my bike and just make sure it's all ready for Bike Park Wales, get all my gear ready, and uh, yeah, I'll see you on my birthday at Bike Park Wales. Go on YouTube, Go on, mate. Guys. <laughs> it's gonna be a good day. And uh, a big happy birthday to me. I'm spending it with these two, 34 today. Boys, let's just make sure I come home in one piece to my girls, please. Or two. Or two. <laughs> All right, first trail guys, don't know what to expect. First time here at Bike Park Wells today.
brutally and rough in here. on the first run and uh, as you can see the contrast from my last YouTube edit my XC riding it is completely different very steep very technical yeah gonna have a good day got all the right gear on today got my trousers on my new shoes thanks again mum and dad for them and the full face helmet <laughs> Just the back got it. Very tentative. Not done all this stuff in a long time. That sideline here. Chains off. Chains off. Oh. Hold up. Right, well, had a little uh, malfunction there, guys. My chain come off. I've got it all back on. Tighten my chain up a bit. So, fingers crossed, that's the last of the mechanicals of the day. I said, my bike's extremely light, set up for XC riding. It's not used to all this beefy stuff. All right, let's get back on track. All right. Back on close right, Paul. <laughs> Crazy riding these trails, Brian. Super gnarly. Like different like experience like wearing the full face as well you are guys well we just done the first run and uh yeah completely different from my xc riding i've not done gnarly stuff like this in a long time my chain come off on me jay's got a couple of loose spokes paul's a uh, head button signs so uh yeah we're having fun it's good so we're just doing a quick bike check back up to the top and we'll try again Choose a gear, any gear. Tightens up a bit in here. Whoa. 
Lost the pedal. Lost the pedal. Got it. Got it back. Yeah, that drop off come off of me quick. That. How fun was that? That's fucking sick that one. That was awesome, well done mate. Right. Oh, I enjoyed that. Dark in here. <laughs> You're on, Paul. Nice big burns. Oh, these are fun. These are fun. Step up. Yeah, I got him. I'm not a jumper, guys, but I got him. Oh, yeah, I got it.
Where are they gone? Yeah. Well, extremely dark again. Amazing, amazing runs, they go on forever. Oh, that's rough, that is rough. Bit more, tra bit more travel needed, guys. There's pole, see pole. Look at that for a view guys, unreal. White Park Wales gets a thumbs up from me. Yew. Oh my life. Yeah, this is definitely a black trail. Wow, okay. Yeah, I think it's safe to say we're on a black trail, guys. And, uh, obviously just hitting these blinds, so I'm gonna take my time, scope them out. See that jump right there? If I knew it was coming up, I would have hit it. But I'm not. I'm not at that confident level of where I can just, you know, come around a corner and just jump something. <coughs> you alright guys? Well, I'd say we're halfway through the day now, having a brilliant time. My poor little bike, you know, this is my XC bike. And uh, yeah, of course I can do all the runs, but I'm getting dinged all, all over the place. But a brilliant day, highly recommend Bike Park Wales. Going back now, getting some lunch and then getting back up there. Long pump track apparently. A what? Long pump track. Oh pump track. Yeah, definitely definitely a pump track. Power for you. Go on, mate. No, I've got enough for you on this one. No, go on. I don't, right? I'm not enjoying the vibe. <laughs>
carry some speed for him here. Well done, Dan. Awesome, I don't know. Dude. I still don't know after them. Blue trail for the win. Oh. Yo! That's, that's probably one of the funniest runs there. Do you know what? That is a good that's, laugh, that. That's quite fun, isn't it? Nice oh.
The old box slabs. Did not sound good. Oh, you're right, guys. Well, it's the next day now, and I had an awesome day at Bike Park Wales. My very first time there. A couple of the other guys have been a couple of times before, but uh, yeah, what an awesome day! A brilliant way to spend my 34th birthday. I've got to say a big thank you to Paul who drove me and Jamie up there and back again and done a full day's ride. It was so funny. I would say. It took definitely me and Paul a couple of the trails to kind of warm up a little bit. He was headbutting signs and, and bouncing into trees. I lost my chain, um, but and, and Jamie had a few spokes that were loose, so it was just like the monging. Yeah, so the monging didn't quite go to plan, but we still had a good one. Uh, it took, took us a couple of trails to, just to get into it, warm up a little bit. Uh, as you guys know, a lot of my riding is XC riding. I don't really do the gnarly stuff with the jumping, but on the odd occasion, I definitely like to put the full face on and go and hit some descents and hit some jumps. So the bike done amazing. I could have definitely done with more travel, that's for sure. Um, it's definitely one of them places that your bike takes a beating. And on the very last trail, you probably see it or hear it at the end of the edit. But my, um, my bash guard, my frame protector, I don't know if you can see that, but I've, I've patched it up now, but there was a massive hole there. Lucky enough, my frame is all good. But if I didn't have my carbon fiber frame protector on it, that could have been a lot, lot worse. But no, the bike done amazing. I got my light tires on there and I had no slashes or anything. I was, I was running 26 PSI front yesterday and 28 psi back i generally run my tires quite hard to prevent punctures i lose a bit of traction but it's just what i prefer to run so yeah i'm just going to give a bike or my bike a, a good once over now check every nut and bolt make sure it's all good um i just got my my new bars that come through today so i'm going to be running a hundred well i've all i always run 740 mil wide bars and i've got 10 mil rise uh handlebars I've gone for some carbon light. I just want to make my bike that little bit lighter for my XC riding. Um, that's the first mod of many carbon wheels, a lighter cassette and a few other bits and pieces I want to do. But yeah, I hope you enjoy this edit, guys. Um, awesome 34th birthday with the lads at Bike Park Wales. And now I've got Friday off of work and the weekend with beautiful weather to spend with my girls. So yeah, looking forward to it. You lot keep well and I'll catch you all soon. All right guys, catch you later.